Hello, Geminis. This is your reading for the 15th through the 16th. This is for Geminis, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you guys are new, welcome to the channel. Please hit the like button, share the video, and subscribe. Let's see what's going on with my Geminis today. Hmm. I get that you guys are feeling very caught up in your head, to be honest with you, because as I was shuffling, I saw the Nine of Swords, um, thinking, overthinking, rethinking what you're overthinking, like, I, I don't get very a very good feeling from this. I, I feel like you guys are almost trapped in, like, this on this rat wheel of thinking over and over and over again here okay let me go ahead and before I continue with that let me pull some some angel cards for you guys here let's see hmm. this could be the one you've already met the romantic partner that you seek hmm. I feel like I feel that I feel you guys like really kind of thinking like who is this person reconciliation someone from your past is returning to your life hmm hmm, hmm, hmm. this is what all this thinking is about romantic feelings your feelings are real and worth exploring so if you guys are overthinking this situation the person that you're thinking about the person that you were heavily thinking about, nine times out of ten is the one. Nine times out of ten is the one. Because these cards, they do not lie, okay? And I feel like you are you're fighting with something here. There's something that you guys I feel like there there's a fear attached to these feelings because maybe you felt like um, you know, you were done with love at one point or you know, something like that. Okay, let's see what else is going on here the six of swords you guys are wanting to leave something behind leave these thoughts behind you're tired of thinking about whatever it is that you're replaying over and over and over again in your head and um, I feel like maybe the situation was was very toxic at one point and um, you guys you still feel very attached to this person this individual here hmm there is definitely something, there's something going on with my Geminis where you guys are probably feeling a lot of heavy energy, lots of heavy energy, okay? And I feel like whatever it is that you guys have been thinking, um, that you've been kind of like over exaggerating on or... Um, thinking that this cannot happen, this is not the one, um, you can't be in love, or this, you know, what, whatever, whatever thoughts um, you guys have been bothered by, I feel like that's coming to an end, okay? And I feel like whatever issues you've had with someone, that's coming to an end as well. I feel like this situation is will be transformed here. I definitely get that. Then we have the strength. I think there is definitely definitely change that you would like to see. Definitely, if you've been fighting, reconciling with someone, making something right, apologizing, whatever, I see you guys facing that shit head on. That's what I see for you. I see you facing your fears. Most definitely. Hmm. Eight of Cups. I feel as though either either you guys walked away from someone. Let's say you guys walked away, physically walked away from someone. There's somebody else here, whoever this is, Pisces, an individual possibly, um, has now decided that, you know what, Gemini is right. Gemini does not want to be with me, so I may as well go, um, in, you know, down a different path, okay? So energetically, this person feels like um, they just need to do what they need to to be happy, or you guys felt, felt like this at one point, but now you're struggling with this. 
somebody's struggling with the fact that um, the other person walked away or that they walked away and possibly have made a mistake is what I'm getting from this. I feel a mistake. Um, somebody feeling like they made a mistake here. Okay. And somebody has moved on, you know, by themselves here. But now it's like being unsure if walking away, if moving away was the right thing to do. That's where you guys are right now. Um, not knowing if, if walking away from this, this person was the right thing to do. Or if they walked away, they're not knowing if it's the right thing to do, if it was the right thing to do. Trapped. Trapped in these thoughts. Replaying over and over again. I feel like you guys definitely want to revisit the situ situation, but you have not made a decision yet. You've not made a decision yet. And that's where this devil energy is coming in at. Because I feel like your fears are stopping you from making this decision. Or them. Then we have a hanged man feeling stuck but I get that um, somebody's coming to a halt here and I feel I feel like you know the hanged band is, is like somebody that really just takes their hands off of it and does absolutely nothing but I don't feel like this person is doing absolutely nothing. I feel like this person is taking some time out to kind of, you know, look at themselves, to 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 see what it is that they have done, what what it is that they can change in this situation because it's falling right under death. This is taking a pause to see what can be changed, what can happen, what can be transformed in this situation in order to reconcile. Somebody's at a crossroads here. For sure. And then the Four of Cups. Hmm. Somebody here, I feel, took the other one's love for granted. And whoever it was that took the other one's love for granted is now wanting that person to offer again. Now they want the cup. They This person knows exactly um, what they've done in this situation. Now they want the cup. Now they want to change. Now they want to do, you know, what what is necessary in this situation, okay? Hmm. Yeah, Pentacles there. I feel like there's a, an Aries, um, maybe a Capricorn individual. I see Capricorn, Aries, Leo, Scorpio, um, Cancer, Pisces, Aquarius. In your reading but there's somebody I feel that you guys feel like you turned your back on before um, but I get that you see this person as this is this is where you have been happy before this was a happy situation for you once upon a time this is a, a committed queen here, whether male or female. Probably has their own home, um, probably has children, but now I feel like this person is definitely single, but this person also likes commitment. Okay, They like stability, security, very supportive um, person takes care of the people that they love. Hmm. Let's see. 
King of Pentacles is there. And we have the Two of Pentacles. Huh. This person has their back turned to this situation. And I don't really feel like they are offering, um, they're not open right now to extending themselves. Not to this situation. Because this situation right here, I feel like it, it, it was unsure. It was unsteady. It was off balance. Um, there was possible juggling going on here, whether it was, you know, two people or there was a level of unsurety. Okay, and so now this person I feel like is focused on other things. I don't get that this person is in a relationship. I think this is all about them um, finding balance and harmony in their own life, finding their happiness separate from whatever happened between you guys is what I'm getting here, okay? But I'm, what I'm getting too is that I feel that you guys probably fought, fought your feelings for the longest for this individual and they for you as well. But I, I'm feeling more so that you guys probably fought yourself from this person. And this person probably at some point was forced to like, you know, just leave it behind because um, you can't stay present in a situation by yourself. And so that's what I'm getting from this, okay? So that's what I have for you guys, and I will be speaking with you soon.